Hey everyone, Matt Saletti here on behalf of ADSR, taking a look at the Machine 2.6.5 update that has added a great new feature that allows you to preserve your audio and MIDI routings as you would change through different groups. This is a very important feature update, one I've been waiting for for a while. And why is it important? Well, we know Machine, you can actually set your outputs individually for each sound. This is a great thing to do inside of your DAW, so I can route the kick to a separate audio track, the snare, etc. I might want to do this because I might want to use native plugins from Ableton, like a beat repeat on my kick, or a vinyl distortion on my snare, or a filter delay send on my hi-hat, all this kind of stuff. I can't load those inside a machine standalone. And what's interesting is that machine has done a lot, uh, Native Instruments has done a lot of research that shows most people use machine as a plugin inside the DAW. So this has a lot of implications for everybody. So let's take a re look at how you would do this. I got a simple drum track going here and let's just uh, hit play here. Now currently machine is only playing on the track it's loaded to. So we'll come into the routings and at the sound level, just route each individual output to an external output. And coincidentally, here inside of the DAW, I've already gone out and mapped those as well. So point to machine inside of Ableton for this instance and select the same output two, three, and four in this case. And now after record enabling everything, we should be able to hear it as such. Now, I don't like this kit necessarily. It's just the first one I grabbed. So now we can actually come in and audition different kits. And there we go. So you heard no disruption. You saw nothing happen with the audio routings because by default now, that is the behavior that will transpire. If I was to go ahead and touch this button called plus routing, the next time I switch, it'll go back to the old behavior that we've been used to before this update. So for instance, if I hit uh, the next kit, watch what happens to the destination. It's gonna go right back to the group. And I now lose those routings for those individual tracks. So. A simple feature request that's been enabled uh, is going to be a very helpful workflow for most people inside of the DAW and a very welcome addition. So check it out, play with it yourself. 